This is a full moon to new moon self-care tip. Expect to feel tired after the moon have gone to 100% full illumination. The time from the full moon to the new moon is about the light growing dimmer. It's a metaphor for our energy. It's normally during these two weeks that I hear most from people, I'm so tired and I don't know why. Well, we're 70% water and the moon has a direct impact on tides, water, and natural cycles with humans. So, checking in with where the moon is in terms of illumination can give you a really helpful indicator around how much energy you will have in your tank. Then you can plan your actions accordingly and adjust your self-care to make sure you're ready to go. It's time to wind down, embrace, and really lean into the need for rest, nourishment, and recovery when the moon goes from full back to new. So if you'd like to learn more about how to tie your self-care to the moon phases, click the link below to join my Lunar Wisdom and Self-Care Challenge for 2023 and 2024. Lunar-based self-care has the greatest chances of helping you feel emotionally and in your environment the way that you want to feel. You can also check out my free beauty therapy checklist for more ideas on how to work self-care through beauty processes. And if you want to take a deep dive, you can check out my lunar-based self-care book, The Lunar Wisdom Formula for Beauty and Self-Care. Like I always say, life does come with an instruction manual. It's written in the stars, or in this case, it is powered by the moon. Sending you lots of light and love, wise ones. Take care.